get this turned on here. That's better. All right, let's get back into this farm. Hopefully we can finish out spring. <clears throat> Okay, let's see what we got going on. I'm almost the next level up. I think this was supposed to tell me my luck, but it definitely doesn't. Oh well. <gasps> Ooh, strawberries are done. Hmm. All right, let's see. Hopefully these will give me some good money. Let the little chickies out. Why are you so angry? Hmm. Maybe I didn't pet her yesterday. Gotta water these crops, and then I think I'm gonna take the ancient seed over to the museum. What was it that I have left to make that bee house? Oh, that's right, I sold off all my coal. Okay, so gotta go get that. Hmm. Maybe I should have held on to some of those strawberries to sell myself. Have I already done this? Let's see. Oh, it's not that one. Yeah, okay. I can sell this one. Hmm. Yeah, that's fine. I wish you could like interact with those animals that hop around. Let's see what we have. I need an iron bar. I have one. Don't know if I want to give it to her though. Flower dance is coming up and I don't have anybody who likes me right now so I think I'm gonna be alone. Hmm. Let's go get us an ancient seed. This is probably one of the earliest times I've ever gotten one of these. And the good thing is they grow in all three seasons, uh, spring, summer, and fall. So if I can get one of these growing right now, that would be great. 
I think I just have to collect the rewards from before. Yeah, there we go. I don't really want that. So now I'll have two of them. And let's see, what else do we need to do? We could process that geode and maybe get some coal from blacksmith. Let's see what we get in here. Didn't realize coal was going to be that much. Okay. Hmm. Guess we'll make a little loop through the beach. Yay, there's something good here today. So I've already gotten the largemouth bass. What other fish do I need? Hmm, if I go fishing right now, I might be able to catch a, I think it's in spring, a tilapia? I don't remember if that's in spring or summer. Oh, uh, hmm. Forty, thirty-seven. Mm. Wow, that's worth a lot more than I thought. I guess I'll just... I need to get a bigger backpack. That's what I need. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Hmm. So I need to get some coal. Throw some stuff in the bin first. She always looks so sad. chicken are so funny. Okay. Sell this stuff. And plant some ancient seeds. I feel like I should make a special place for these guys. <laughs> hmm. Well, I'm planning on making a pathway through here at some point, so maybe I'll just put it right here for now. That should be all right. Okay, let's get this mayo. <coughs> Leveled up. Okay. So we got that. I think I'm going to try and go back into the mines. I need to put some of this stuff away. Mm. I've almost got enough copper bars to make the silo. So, if I can get some more copper, that would be great. Might as well go ahead and plant these two wild seeds and see what they get. Ooh, ooh, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay. Out of water. Maybe I should get a well. I think I might do that. 
She said, I think it was just a hundred stones, so maybe I'll get one and put it like right by my house. She should be at work today. Here we go. Oh, but I don't think I have enough money, so maybe another day. What's this? I keep hoping that I'll see a dinosaur egg up here because that's where they'll appear. Then I could go ahead and get those little baby dinosaurs. Alrighty. Hmm. Pretty good. I think I'm gonna try to get at least another five levels down. Really need to get a move on here. to get those guys quick because if they sneak away they can become the flying ones and I really don't like those. Here we go. Where's the ladder? Oh yay, got some coal. That's good. So now I have five and I need eight. Hmm. I don't think this was a good luck day, but you know, you're not gonna have good luck every day. I think you should just get out anyway and just know what you're gonna expect. So many people will refuse to go into the mines on unlucky days, but there are some things that you can only get a lot of on those kind of days if you're trying to farm monsters or something. Or rocks, apparently, because I'm not finding the exit. There we go, right by the elevator. Perfect. Oh, good, this one already has one. So we got that. Let's see if there's any more. Yeah, I should get at least... Oh, there's a lot over there. Hmm. start checking in crates and stuff and maybe I'll find some cave carrots. Oops. There's that. Uh, I'm just gonna try and see if I can find the exit before I go and waste all of my energy, which I have such precious little of. I think I already got the um, star drop from this, the spring fair, but I should have brought those bombs. Even though they're little, they would do better than this. Yeah, I don't even know. I really need to come back next time with some food. I don't think I'm going to make it. And I only got one coal, but I got some copper, so... Let's see. I just need to plan better next time. Bring some food. Nighttime. I think I should get a good amount of money, though, because I did some good foraging today and got those strawberries, so hopefully that'll give me a jump start. I'll be able to get a well, maybe a silo, since I've got more copper. 
Hi, how are you doing? Thanks for joining the stream. Let's see, Kota Toshia. Welcome, thanks for coming. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to try and start one of these. Pretty soon I should have enough to make the silo, which would be great. Okay. I've never actually really used this before, but maybe it would be useful right now. Look at that! Yeah, I got some good money from those strawberries. That's awesome. Oh, we've only got... Ooh, it's raining today, so that means I don't have to water. There's some more energy there. How are we doing on luck? Okay, that's not bad. Got a new recipe. Flower dance. Nobody likes me right now, Mayor Lewis, so... Got five copper bars. I think I've got plenty of that there. And I might have enough money. I think I can go and make one of these. I don't remember if I need fiber or not. Yep, I think I'm going to go try and do that today. It looks like we got a lot of forage going on on the farm, so that's great. My chickens are going to be hungry. Sorry, chickens. Excuse me. Okay. Here we go. So sooner or later, I'm surprised I haven't heard from that scientist guy about what's going in my cave. Nothing's in there right now. I don't remember when that's supposed to happen. Oh, seriously, it's too early. Well, hmm. Maybe I can catch some good stuff in the lake over here while I'm waiting. Hey, welcome back. I didn't know you'd gone. Thanks for coming back. Just waiting on the, uh, what you call it to open, the carpenter. Because my chickens need some food. Okay. While I'm waiting, I wonder, let's see. Just because I'm impatient. Instant build. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Because... Cheating's fun for impatient people. I don't want to completely ruin the game, but just a few little annoying things like that. Yes! Yeah, I've got a lot of stuff on here. So we've got this one, and then also the spawn menu. I really wish I knew what this thing was, but anyway, this spawn menu is supposed to have things that never even made it into the game. Fun for messing with people, but definitely game breaking. Ugh, so close, come on, just waiting on her to open. Yeah, I know, it's, it's fun to play with, but definitely wouldn't recommend it if you're trying to actually play the game. Come on, come on. There we go. So, let's 
so we want to get a silo. Where to put it? I guess I'll just put it right by the chicken house. Which mods are you using right now? I've got uh, tons of them, and at least five of them use the Stardew modding API, so <laughs> I think that's the CJB menu and everything. There we go. So now we've got a little silo. Let's cut some of this grass for the chickies. Alright, see now we got some food and you guys won't be mad at me. That's better. Hi Steve, how you doing? Thanks for dropping by. Let's see, got everything watered. Okay, yeah, I actually don't have that one where you can see where everybody is. I don't know why, but I kind of like just trying to keep up with everybody's schedule. Yeah, I've seen that one too, where you can see if they love you or not. I think this, I'm using the, um, something like a UI, something that's supposed to, eh, it, you'll see it tomorrow morning. It'll show you a little hand icon to let you know that you haven't pet that person yet. I'm doing great, Steve. How are you? Happy Friday. Let's see. Yeah, but yeah, I have tons of mods on this thing, and I'm really looking forward to getting to see all of them, you know, because my house isn't fully upgraded, so can't see that. Yeah, so this, this does something similar. It is YouTube chat, too. Yeah, I have it. Um, I use something called Restream and so it shows both chats and I have it set that it'll pop up on the screen so people know who I'm talking to and don't think I'm crazy. <laughs> they are! Yeah, I have cardinals and then I have my goats will be deer. This mod will turn it into, turn your chickens into cardinals or toucans I think or the other one. But I just thought these were really cute, especially in winter when you see their little red birds. Yeah, of course! Yeah, so um, there's a safe way to do it that you won't ruin your farm. Believe me, I have had the few mods that broke my game and had to take them out. But um, So what you do, if you've already got the, let's see, how did you install, oh yay, I got something new. How did you install those other mods if um, you're not, they should be installed the same way. Did you get those off of Nexus? Uh, because what what you do is you'll go into Nexus Mods for Stardew, and it's all basically the same. Um, yeah, so it's all basically the same thing. What you're going to do, and some, some players will give you instructions, some don't. Okay, yeah, so if you've used the Stardew Modding API, then the visual mods are a lot simpler. You don't have to use that stuff at all. Uh, what you'll do, and a lot of the times the modders will structure their mods in a way that kind of makes sense. Oh, I haven't even been getting these. That'll make sense for how to install it. And then some of them will put readme files to tell you how to use them. But here's what you do. You'll go uh, open the file. Some of them are zipped. I've had to actually get um, a program to open some of the RAR files, but You'll unzip the file, and then a lot of the times they'll structure them to kind of show you where to copy and paste them. So let's see, I'll give you an example. For the farm animals, there's going to be, if you look into your Stardew folder, which you're going to find under Steam Apps um, and Content. Yeah, I don't think I want any of those. So go to your Steam folder in your computer, go to Steam Apps, and then you'll find the Stardew folder. In there, once you get into content, there'll be all these different well-labeled organized folders. Some will say animals, texture, 
um, files, maps, and everything. And there's usually directions within the mod, but basically you copy the file from the mod and paste it into, literally, yeah, paste it into the place where it would go originally. But don't just replace it. If you want to protect your game, what you should do is, before you paste it, go to the original file that you're replacing, like I was replacing the white chickens. So before you just paste it and um, re completely replace the old file, go and type in the file name that's the original one. Change the name of that file and put like something in parentheses that says original. That's what people mean when they're saying back up your file. That way, you know, so the game's not going to draw from the old file, but if you ever need to remove the mod, all you have to do... Oh, thanks for following. I appreciate it. What is that? It's Edith? Thanks so much. Um, yeah, so just change the name. That's pretty much it. Uh, there are some mods that conflict, so you might just need to play around depending on what you're changing. I've had a few mods that do map recolor, map recolorings, and you'll see... Um, there are a few places that look a little off. So like this map recolor I'm doing is a little bit less yellow than it typically is. There's a handful of map recolors. This one is from Emi Stardew. And I actually post all of the links that I have for my mods on the last Stardew video I did yesterday. So if you wanted to check those out, I could copy and paste them into this one again just to make it easy. I think I'll do that. But yeah, so it's it's pretty straightforward and it's really fun to play with. People come out with a lot of crazy stuff. Um, I've had Pokemon for my animals on my farm, which is fun. Changing the way people look in town is fun. And um, I think I'm going to, now that I've got a little bit of food, I think I'm going to try and go down in the mines a bit. But when I get back home, I'll show you. I have a uh, cave expansion that has an entirely new area back behind my cave that has like a swimming hole and teleporting circles, everything. So, yeah, if you've got the, sm if you've got the smappy stuff down, that stuff's pretty easy. Yes, good. Oh... Man, this is a lot better luck day than I was having yesterday. Maybe I was wrong and it does make a huge difference. All right, let's wait for this dude to come out. <laughs> well, hey, Mirad, thanks for watching. Hope you're having a good Friday. Let's see. Okay, hopefully we'll find the exit here soon. I'm trying to get down a little bit and then head home. Since I didn't have to water anything. Yeah, you're welcome. Okay. Oh, hopefully we'll get something good out of this barrel. Nope. Nothing. I really should try and upgrade this pickaxe soon. Oh gosh. I think in this one it's going to be Elliot, just because he kind of looks like the Beast from Beauty and the Beast. And this girl's named Belle. But I'm torn between him and Sam, because Sam's just really nice. But he kind of is like a Super Saiyan. I don't know how I feel about that. Plus, his room that you get... I don't know. I guess I'm trying to stick with a the theme on this one. His room that you get's got the band stuff. But Elliot's room has like a giant bookcase and everything. And that would be really classy looking. So, probably Elliot. But he's a bit difficult. I tried to give him... What did I give him yesterday? I don't remember. I gave him something and he didn't like it. I think it was a salmon berry. So, <laughs> I think I'm actually on better terms with Sam right now, but come fall when I have a pomegranate tree, it'll be all uphill from there. Elliot loves pomegranates. 
Oh, I hate these levels, man. Let's see. I'm going to eat one of these. Let's eat the plain one. Ooh, that's pretty good. Actually, uh, what's his name? Shane really likes salmon berries. So, oddly enough. Oh, that was good luck. Yes, we made it down to 20. Finally got a new sword. I really hate this club. It's so slow. Okay, here we go. I'm headed out. Yeah, Linus will pretty take pretty much take any kind of food. But I I was getting the berries mixed up because I think Elliot likes blackberries, which you can pick. Yes, mess with the mods. Let me know what you decide on getting. There's some there's a ton of really cool stuff coming out. I think one of my two of my favorite modders are Emi Stardew and Strawberry Milk. They do a lot of the retextures of the buildings and the farm. All right, so let's see. I wonder if this place will still be daytime in here. Yep, so this is my cave expansion. So you walk into the cave and straight back there's this swimming hole. And all of this is farmable land. So it gives you a lot of extra space if you want it. So you can swim around in here just like the, um, what you call it? spa or whatever which my spa is actually altered as well it's like a hot springs instead of like the gross pool it is so there's that and I think I can get over there from here somehow well maybe it's up a little bit yeah there we go so there's this other area These are the fairy circles I was talking about. So each one of these will teleport you to a different location. And down here, I think there's some Judy Mo houses. I don't really know what they do, but you can go in one. So there's this whole fun little area down here. Let's see. And then over here is just a giant farmable area, like a huge field. So sometimes it can be pretty helpful. I really have no way to, it is late. I know I'm really bad about staying up in this game. I'm going to get an energy penalty. I haven't. Is it um, on the computer? I've been making a list of stuff that I want to check out. So, Secret of Mana. Let's see. Let me add that on this handy list I've got going on. Love getting new game ideas. Secret. Hey again, Douglas. I remember you from yesterday. Oh my goodness, that, ev that is even better. I bet you I can get um, get it on this emulator I have for the Super NES. Oh no, don't worry. Dating yourself. It's cool to play this. It's cool to play the SNES these days. Who knows how old you could be? Shoot, inventory's full. Hopefully, I'll get those last few golden. So, how are you doing today, Douglas? Thanks for coming back by. Everybody, I mean, it's cool to play those things. I've got, um, we used to have one at home. We had that, and we also had an N64. And the only one we hung on to was the N64. That's kind of what I grew up playing. Oh, yes, look at that. Perfect. We got two more golden parsnips, so now I can take that to the community center. I'm really happy about that. Hey again, Sid Jr. I gotta get another animal so I could name it after you like I said I would. Let's see. I just got a silo. 
And pretty soon I think I should be able to afford a barn, so I think I'll go for that. Oh, nice. You're really lucky. You got to have that growing up. That's awesome. So what were some of your favorite games to play on that then? I gotta think about what I'm doing. I need to take that by the museum, that by the community center, and I want to try to get a barn. Did I get the rocks out of here? Yeah, rocks, wood. Thank you. Okie doke. See this? This little icon will tell you if you need to pet your animals. It has it for my cat too. I just got a emulator on my phone so I could play the original Legend of Zelda games on there. They are hard. I forget how hard they are. And ruthless. You die and it's all over. I couldn't even make it past the first dungeon. I worked so hard. Yay, congrats! So did they work out for you? All the ones that I had posted on the video before? I was just talking to somebody earlier on how to install those. Which ones did you end up getting, Douglas? Let's see. I think I'm going to cut some more of this grass. Need to get some food for my chickies. <laughs> did you get this grass one? What all did you choose to get? Oh, there's some morel up there. Look at this. Got a good foraging day today. Nice. Yeah. I did too. We loved... Um, I was a Mario girl growing up, but recently I've kind of gotten into Zelda and realized why everybody loves it so much. Could believe that... I guess it's when you're a kid, you kind of just get into whatever your parents play. Flower dance. I, nobody's going to like me. I don't know that I'm going to go to the flower dance. Well, actually, I might go just to get the recipe for the flower pot things because they look different in this game that I've got. They would really not, they make my house look a little better. Oh, even though I'm going to get rejected, I don't think anybody likes me enough for that. Oh my gosh, Shane actually likes me enough. See, it's those salmon berries. I cannot believe this. Shane usually hates everybody. Okay. This is a lot of money. Oh no. Okay, okay. Uh, what to get rid of? It's a recipe, dude. I don't need to... Hmm. How much money do I have left? I can only get one. I'm not gonna go for it. I'm just gonna grow my own. Back away, Leah. See, doesn't he look like Beast? I kind of want to try out some portrait mods. Some of them are really good. All right, guys. I cannot believe I am starting. I don't know that he can do... Oh, yeah, he can't... Oh, my goodness. No! But I have three hearts. I thought that's all you needed. Shovel Knight's really cool, too. I think they've got that on the Switch as well. I guess let's get started. He's the highest hearts that I have anyway. Hot Peppers. Yes, they are his favorite. I think those only come out in the summer, though. Right? Like, at least Elliot would be nice if I would have asked him. I just hate how, like, in this dance... I don't know why, but Haley... Haley just really makes me mad. You thought Elliot was a girl. Oh my goodness. His long hair is very, um, this gorgeous, luxurious flowing hair. Like those commercials. Hmm, okay. So typically those files are 
so that you could see what you've got downloaded. So you don't copy and paste those into your files. You're just going to be using the, uh, what is the extension for the mods? You're not using any of the image files. It's just the ones that match the name of the one in your game. Yeah, so those are just the same as you would have found on the Nexus page to let you know what that mod is. Because for people like, who actually, I'm going to hang on to that. It is always sad. I think the only person I've ever been able to be friends with the first year, honestly, I think I was able to be friends with Shane one year. Not this one. Rejected, though. Let's see. Yeah, that's good. Honestly, I think I could make it to the X and B. That's right. Well, I wasn't planning on marrying Shane, but it's just because he's like the only other person who likes um, Spring Forage. I mean, the old guy likes leeks, but Shane's the only one, like someone said, other than Linus, that likes the salmon berries. You know, honestly, I don't know. Maybe, I think I've married Shane once before. Maybe that would work out. He's got some pretty cute cutscenes, though. Plus, you get the blue chickens, which are really pretty. So, let's see. Are you able to dance with... I think you are. Aren't you able to dance with a girl? I don't know. She has a birthday early on. Yeah. Let's see. I think this... Yeah, she does. She does. Yeah, see, Shane's the only other person that I've ever been able to get high enough because he likes the berries that start growing around like the middle of the month. Um, Leah's, Leah's alright. I think. I'm a little salty towards her just because oh I've already done that one. Just because she's usually paired up with Elliot. And he was actually the first person. You get blue chickens if you get to level 8 friendship with Shane. So maybe I will try that. He's the real salty one. Maybe that would be f more fitting. Put him on this adorable pink flowery farm. <laughs> but yeah, you can get really pretty blue chickens if you get to his eight heart event. Whether you marry him or not, you'll get him. So grow those peppers. Yes. All right, let's see. I guess that's it for the day. I don't like how they pretty much take your entire day for these things. Uh, let's see, summer is almost over. I almost wanted to sleep through the rest of it. Oh wait, no, I'm gonna hang on to this because I wanna try and, uh, it's gonna try and build a barn. But let's see. I want to sell a few more things and see how much more money I can squeeze out of this day. Since I blew half of my money, or two-thirds of my money, on that flour recipe. That's right. Yeah, Steve has it right. Crossing fingers for you. Hopefully they will. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, so they have a chance of being blue. I think it's like a one in four chance. Okay, look, we're back up. Okay, I think I can make that much. Especially with these cauliflower. Let's see. Wish I had a seed maker. But I'm not going to push it. It's almost at the end. I don't know. I've never actually used that for any other mods but the cheats menus and stuff. I've never used it for the visual ones. Let's see. Just make sure that when you change the name of your, uh, that when you add the new one in, because some of them don't put the name correctly in their mod file. So just make sure that when you copy and paste that the mod name is the same as what the original was, or else the game won't recognize it. I've had a couple that did that, and it 
it was really frustrating until I figured out what was going on. <clears throat> okay, so I think I'm going to go take this stuff to Pierre. It's Thursday, so the uh, carpenter should be open today. Yeah. How much? I wonder what I would need to do to make a tapper. So I just need copper bars. I was going to make a crab pot. I need some iron for that. Okay. And the tub of flowers. Here it is. Okay, so I need tulip, jazz, poppy, and spangle. Go ahead and get one of those. What? Okay, hey, that's my first night bot thing. Sorry, I don't know what you were... Did it work? That's probably what you were doing, was like really excited. Uh, I don't know anything about night bot. Someone was telling me about it yesterday. <clears throat> so I just put it on there, but I have no idea how it works. He actually really likes eggs, too, so, because he loves chickens. Yay. Love me, Shane. Yeah. Okay, I gotta figure out this Nightbot thing. Sorry. <sighs> Maybe I should just take it off for now. Waiting on the store to open so I can make some money. What's going on here? Oh, I can do that. Boo. Well, that's no fun. I need to take that. I need to learn more about Nightbot before I put it on. <laughs> all right, let's make all this money. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's not his favorite thing. I think the peppers are his favorite as well as beer, which I can get pretty easily. Okay, so we've got plenty of stone. I think I still need more though. I might be able to afford to buy some, but I'm going to try and chop down some trees. You hate the largemouth bass? Yes, go try. Hopefully it'll work. Let's see. I think I actually need quite a lot of stone. We'll see. <laughs> I love that smiley face. <clears throat> Alright, let's see how far off I am, and I might be able to just get a few more. I wish I had the quarry. Let's see. What do I need to get a barn? 150 stone, which I'm pretty close. Oh, it's 6,000? I thought it was four. Oh, that's the coop. Boo. Okay, might not get to do that today. But that's okay. So I need a little bit more stone and a lot more wood. I'll just work on that today. And hopefully make some more money tomorrow. We could go ahead and try to get that largemouth bass. Oh, another thing we could get. Let's see. What are you saying, Sid? YouTube has warned you. They notified you when I was live. The Twitch saved you then. What do you mean? I think I'm going to try. Oh, gosh. This is it. You guys. Oh, that was such a crappy fish. I should have been paying more attention. Okay. I'm going to get this catfish today, guys. Maybe. Shoot. <laughs> This is so terrible. I need to go get some bait or some, uh, what you call it? Lures. This is my favorite spot for catching catfish is right here at the bottom of the bridge. I get so many hooked on the line here. The catfish is, yeah. I think the one that I have to get is the largemouth bass. But 
you're never going to get better if you don't practice, so might as well do this for a bit. It's only now noon, so I'll do this for a little bit and then head to the mines to get some more stones. Goodness! Those catfish don't play around. I'm going to be so happy whenever I catch one. You can get them out of the garbage can too, but it's pretty rare. Okay. I gotta be ready for it every time now. Let's see. I hate it too, Murad. Probably butchering your name, I'm sorry. I really... I think, honestly, the catfish is probably for the time that you need it in the game, the hardest ca hardest fish to catch. Obviously the legend is the hardest fish to catch, but by that time you have access to the stronger rods and the lures and everything. Yeah, yeah, I do. Um, so let's see, each one is for a different season. So for example, this is actually a good time to show you if I can hook the legend. Um, okay, so the special fish, you've got legend, the crimson fish, I think the other one is like a glacier fish, there's the mutant carp, and let me think, the angler fish, which I'm not really sure what its name is. So for legend, you want to cast right out of here, I'm not paying attention. In spring, legend only comes out in spring in the rain. So you really got to hit like max distance. Let's see if I can hook him. But so the legend comes out in the spring in the rain and it's right at this log down here. Oh. Let me get rid of a couple of things. I don't know if I'll even be able to hook him, but... Then the crimson fish is the next one in summer, and you have to go to the eastern dock on the other side after you build the bridge and cast off of the left side of the dock. That's where the crimson fish is going to be in the summer. Then fall is where you get the angler fish, and what you do is go stand... Oh, look, I got the largemouth bass. That's good. Um... I think Willie wanted that. The angler fish, you go to the bridge that crosses the river. I'll show you in a second. And cast upward. It's the bridge that's to directly to the left of um yeah, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to hook him. Let's see if I can get him right here. Yeah, finally, I got the largemouth bass. Nah, I don't think I'm going to hook the legend right now. I think he'll only come out after you have a certain level of fishing experience. Mm. I really don't want to get rid of any of this, but... Okay. So... Spring is the legend, summer is crimson fish, fall is the angler. I'm going to show you where that bridge is now. Then the winter is the glacier fish, and you go to the island that's in the center. Let me pull up the map. This, it's not really an accurate map, but you know this little island that's right here between the, the mouse house and the spring onions area? In winter, cast south of the furthest south po point on that island, and you'll catch glacier fish. And that's where all four of the legendary fish are. So the bridge I was talking about is this one right here. You stand right in the middle and cast upward like this, and you'll hook the angler fish. So that's basically all four, and there are some more difficult fish, like if you go fishing in the mines. Oh wait, and the mutant carp is when you go fishing. That one is the easiest of all of them. 
that's when you go fishing in the sewers. So pretty much the only two things that you can catch. I think I'm actually going to go to the beach and sell, the, sell these fish. I think I can make it. Basically, the only two fish you can catch in the sewers are carp and mutant carp. So it's a little bit easier to come by. I don't know if the new fish that they added, the slime jack, is a legendary fish, but that one you can catch in the witch's lair. Um, I think, no, no, the slime jack is what you catch in the little bug lair where you get the talisman. There's a different fish that you catch in the witch's lair. Something evil. I sell one of those. Look, I have 6,000 now. If only I had all the wood I needed. So let's see, he wanted this. Let me make sure. Uh, yeah, Willy. And I get to keep the fish, so. Yay. Now I need to sell it. Awesome. Okay, you know, honestly, I might be able to get this, but... I don't know if I want to spend money on that right now. So if I just had a few more rocks, I need 25 more rocks and a whole bunch more wood. Is that Alfred, Andrew? One of my cats is being loud and he wants attention. Poor baby. Okay. I don't think I can... Uh... Yeah, it totally is Alfred. Yeah, I am like a quarter of a heart of Elliot, so really far off. Might actually end up going for Shane, because he's easy to find, easy to please. He likes beer and peppers. Straightforward. Oh my gosh, I got some food! That's awesome! Hey, Alex. I really don't ever go for Alex. Did I already give you a gift today, Shane? Yeah. That place is closed. That place is going to be closed in a second, so I'm just going to head home and sell all this stuff. Maybe use the last bit of my energy today to chop some trees. Clear out my farm a bit and work towards the barn, because I need to name somebody Sid. That's my goal. You get the most for your effort by chopping the fully grown trees, so I'm going to do that. I think I'll leave these. They're actually kind of nice. Clear out some of this stuff over here. Got to keep an eye on my energy here. I do have that field snack, though, so... I might be able to keep my energy up. So I have now... When I chop trees, I try to alternate between types of trees so that I can work towards getting a um, field snack off of their seeds. So pink, white, green in this case. I really love these trees a lot more than the original tree designs for some reason. Aw. Let's see. Hmm. Okay. Okay, so now I have I am still nowhere close, but that's okay. A little bit at a time. I kind of wish that you could trade in the red wood for the brown wood with the carpenter. Oh, so sweet. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to get this one. I'm doing alright on energy. Let's go find a pink tree now. 
There's a pink tree. It's only 840. This is the daily grind of Stardew. Let's see. I'm going to try and clear this out so they can get some trees growing around them. <laughs> I know, it's so painful cutting this cute grass, but it must be done. It'll grow back. I really want to put some grass starter right around here because I don't think it grows naturally on the grassy parts. Oh, I'm at 200. Okay, I can do this. I really don't want to cut any more of my own trees, though. I like where they are. Let's see. You died? What do you mean you died? Did your mods not work out? Oh, you died in the game. That's the worst. Were you in the mines or something? I hate when they take all your stuff and then you lose like 10 levels. Yeah, that sucks a lot because then you lose like 10 levels in the mines that you worked really hard to get. It's so frustrating. Let's eat an egg. I kind of wish too that when you like shake the trees like that, you could get seeds out of them. Does that work? Okay, so I think I'm going to call that a day. Let's toss this stuff in. Okay. Mm. Oh, I can sell this, I think. I was hanging on to one of them for some reason. Okay. My cat is in the bed. Move. There we go. That was weird. Okay, can make an iron fence preserves jar. That's good. I think I just need wood and coal for that. But I still really want to get that bee house. I wonder how... I think you have to use gold to make the charcoal thing. I am still going to do Skyrim Live. That's going to be tomorrow, Douglas. Yeah, I'm definitely going to do that. I just wanted to get a few more videos of Stardew under here because I really love this game. Oh yeah, good day for the mines. But I just hadn't played it a lot, so. Here we go. Gonna get the, okay, what should I do? Mushrooms or fruit? I've done some with both. Hmm. What do you think? Mushrooms or bats? I think I'm going to go with mushrooms. Because I really, I think mushrooms are more valuable. Hmm, my favorite kind of music. That's difficult. I really do like some of the older stuff. Yeah, mushrooms. Got it. Yeah, I like a lot of the 80s music but I definitely really like calmer things. Like, oh no, oh gosh. Okay, that's not what I wanted to do. Man. I really like calmer stuff like um, Coldplay and some of the, I don't know how to say it, like alternative stuff. And then also all the classic stuff like, uh, you know, you got your Weezer, Blink-182. They are more consistent, I agree. I just, I don't know. It's hard to pin down. I like a lot of kinds of music. Ah, that's true. That's true. Thanks. I feel better now. Let's go pet these chickens. Cluck. Where's the other one? Hmm. Mm -hmm. I really should be trying to make friends with Marnie because I won't be able to do her little quest with the shorts if I'm not friends with her. All right, I think I'm gonna try. I am just a little bit away from having all the wood I need. Was it 300? 
for 350. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Some of the best jam out sessions with Blink 182. Ah, oh, that's true. So maybe I should just keep one and make some seeds out of it later. I know. I did kill a strawberry. It's so sad. All right, what do we got? 313. I think we're good. So now we just need to get... Yeah, me too. So much better music back in the day. I don't even know what they're doing these days. There's some good stuff, but I don't know. It's a lot of lame stuff. Maroon, you know, I mean, just all this. Just put it on a 90s station, 90s hit station. Justin Timberlake's really great. I like Muse. Muse is really great. <laughs> I know. I just want my chickens to be free range. I'm a cheapskate when it comes to fences. I got plenty of hardwood now, though. I think I could do that. Who was Blink-182? I know. I think we just recently missed them. I believe they were in Atlanta, which would have been possible to access. Okay, let's see. Can I make hardwood fences yet? I don't think I can. I'm waiting to make the hardwood fence because I'm pretty sure regular wood fence... I have a mod, but I'm pretty sure regular wood fence doesn't cut it. Huh, if you put lightning rods around the... F around the coop, they don't collapse? Yeah, these are just regular. Excuse me. I'm waiting for the... Three Days Grace is good, too. Let's see. I'm waiting for the ability to make hardwood fences, so... Save a strawberry for later. I'm going to sell that. Need to make some mayo. Oh, gosh. I am... Sneezing is making me not be able to see real well. Okay. <sighs> I thought all the rain would help with allergies, but seems the help helpfulness has gone away. Oh, so I should have mushrooms in here now, right? Or is it going to take a few days? All right, here we go. Good, because I need a red mushroom. And I think a purple one for the um, community center. Let's see. I'm going to go up here. I believe I have enough wood to build a barn. Let's see. So many leaks up here. I need to go see George. Okay. So what do I need, lady? Glad you're at work today. 350? Okay. Okay. I'm so close. I can go do that. How much does a stone cost? 20? Okay. I think I could actually afford that. I think I just was able to barely get that. Okay. Awesome. Let's get that barn. Uh, where to put the barn? So we've got the coop there. Hmm. I do have a horse mod on. I have a Norwegian Fjord horse. Where should I put these? Cows, guys. I kind of want to put them right, like, right here, but I don't want to block the greenhouse like that. Maybe we'll nestle them over here by Grandpa. 
Maybe I should do that and like move the chicken coop over here too and they can be buddies. I think I'll try that. You can always move it. Yeah, I think I will. I think I'll move this guy over here. <sighs> we'll have a little animal area over there. I think I kind of like the way the silo is. Oh, you can't put it over there. I want to put my horse right over here. I hate that the grass like doesn't let you put stuff there. Shadow mirror, just like the horse in Skyrim, huh? That's pretty cool. I haven't gotten Shadow mirror yet, so still working on that one. Maybe I'll put it by the future greenhouse. I think that'd be pretty. Okay. Let's go get us some cows next. So I think I have enough. <laughs> I don't know if there's a shadow mirror. There, you, there actually might be an actual shadow mirror horse mod. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be surprised. You could just get like a dark, really pitch black horse call it that though let's see good thing he's open today I might be able to get enough money to get a whore I mean a cow let's see mm. I think cows are a lot more than that so yes I had the Eevee cat for a long time I really love Eevee let's see what do I want to do I guess I could go get these geodes processed and take this thing over to the museum. Jody, out of the way. It's Friday. I don't think I'll have enough money for a cow until tomorrow. I think she's open tomorrow. Alright, let's take these things down and donate them. And let's see what we get. Yeah, I had a friend who had the dog, their dog in real life was named Evie. It made me really happy. Okay. Oh goodness, Leafeon's really pretty. I don't know which one is my actual favorite though. Oh, yay, I got the chicken statue. Hmm. I think Umbreon was actually... Oh, not Umbreon, sorry. I think Espeon was actually my favorite. Cool, thanks for stopping by, Steve. Have a great rest of your day. I'll be streaming tomorrow, playing some Skyrim if you want to stop by. Let's go put this chicken statue up. Okay, and see how much the cows actually cost. I think she's still open. Okay, 1500 Only a thousand more, that's all. Let's see if we can find anything good down here. Hmm. Oh, it says it's Pierre's birthday, and that lady is here. Let's see if she's got anything good. <laughs> okay. Pufferfish is pretty good. I don't have enough for it, though. Oh, the battery pack would be great. Goodness, if I could get the battery pack. 
Then I could start that whole quest to get into the casino. Mmm, maybe she'll have one soon, another time. What all can I craft? I need to make a preserves jar sometime. I don't know, maybe I'll just wait and make some kegs. <laughs> I wonder what it would be like if you could marry the wizard. I'm sure there's a mod for that. That would be pretty cool. Because he's got a tragic ex-wife story. Okay. In two more days, I'll be able to go get the special uh, Junimo plush and stick it in my house. I wonder if it still looks the same after the uh, interior decorating type mods that I have. Or if it's going to still be a Junimo. I think there's some mods that you could change the plushie's color, but I don't know if I've seen any that actually change what it is. You trained a Sylveon. Yeah, isn't that the fairy, the pink fairy one? I think I actually trained one of those too. I feel like they could have done better with the design. It's really cute, but the bows and stuff, I don't know, I feel like that was a bit much. But it turned out pretty well. The fairy stuff, when they first came out, it's pretty much killed everything, because it's the only thing that really can go against dragon type. Huh. Honestly, I think my favorite Pokemon are always the normal types, just because they're really precious. Like, um, in my first run through Sun, I kept a, um, Furret as my leading Pokemon for, like, the entire game, and just kept training it up. I taught it Hyper Beam, and because I was so nice to it, I taught it, uh, Return, I think? Of this, yeah, it's really nice. <laughs> um... I'm hoping that sometime I'll be able to get Pokemon to be able to stream up here because that would be so much fun. I don't, I have not been able to catch any shiny stuff. Honestly, I feel like it's not even real. Oh, I didn't move this. Have any of you caught any shiny Pokemon? Because I don't really believe they exist because I've never seen any. Never even seen one. Let's see what I can get for this stuff plant these. I really wanted to catch like a shiny, one of the shiny Eevee Pokemon. Seriously? Let's see. What's your name? Thanks for joining us. Let's see. Infinituskinova. Did my best. Let's put this chicken statue in here. Okay. Well, I'll have to get back in there and try to catch something because that would be really fun. It's only 6.50. No, no, no. Let's not do that. Let's go to the mines or something. About to have to make another chest. Ah! Uh, I think it's pretty strong. <laughs> Thanks so much. I think the Bunnieri is strong. It hits pretty hard, but I don't really like its little weird ear thing. I kind of stick more with the um, Teddy Ursa stuff. Steve's back! Everybody celebrate. That's funny. Okay, 720. I think we've got time. I might be able to get down another five levels. I really need to get down to the iron levels. I might try catching a ghost fish, too. See. Yeah, yeah, it's less now. Now that I've got a sword, everything's better. Okay. Come on. I don't know what kind of luck I have today. I think Pierre, Pierre's birthday was today. I don't really care that much about it, but I think he likes vegetables a lot. There we go. 
Okay, let's get a move on. Okay, let's see, diamond. Diamond and pearl. Okay, I think I played pearl. Um, hmm. I wonder if... Was that the first gen they were announced? I wonder if there's actually more in those games because of that. Alright, got pretty lucky here. Moving on down. Let's see. How far can we get in the mines today? Huh. <sighs> This is actually pretty good. Look at that, down five already. Oh gosh. I'm just trying to get down right now. I'm probably, oh shoot. I'm probably missing a ton of ore. Um, I'm just trying to get down because I really need to get to the iron levels. So and get my mining experience up, because like you see, I'm level two, I'm almost level three, but I really want to be able to make bigger bombs. Thanks for subscribing! I really appreciate it. I really don't know how well I'll say your name again, but I appreciate it a ton. Or for following, whichever that was. Let's see. Can I make the bombs yet? No, I can only make the little ones, so I really want to try to just get down I hate this because I'm about to be in the dark levels and I don't like the dark levels because there's those creepy little zombie things. Oh gosh, okay, here we go. Hmm. Are you serious? Because I actually just brought home my DS, the old DS Lite game, Game Boy. I don't have any food. I think I just need to head on up. I'm trying to think. Let's see. Yeah, because Platinum, they didn't. They don't ever do remakes of the third one, you know, in the series. They only do, like, Heart Gold, Soul Silver, but they don't ever come out with the third one. Which, honestly, I'm usually a bigger fan of those. I started off with Yellow, so I guess it kind of stuck with me. So you have to have a both of the games be Pokemon, like have a Pokemon Game Boy game, Game Boy Advance game, and then uh, DS as well. That's true. That's true. I need to do better about that. Look for those barrels. Hmm. Anything I can sell? I get rid of that stuff. Okay. I'll try that because I've. I've always wanted to collect them myself, but never caught a single shiny before. I'm going to keep these in my bag. I might actually use them to get down next time. Mm, I really want to save my coal, so I'm not going to do that just yet. Because I want to make a bee house. Oh, look, I got some pretty good money. All those strawberries. <laughs> yes. Are you just doing the regular sprinklers? I don't even bother with sprinklers until I'm able to get the iridium quality. Too much trouble. I'd rather water. All right, 27th. So tomorrow I'll be able to get... What is this? Oh, nice. Uh, tomorrow I'll be able to get the plushie if I go hit that bush at noon. It's still weird for me not to have this chicken. <laughs> Thank you. I love all the mods I've got on it. Okay, quality sprinklers are pretty good. That's true. It does give you a chance to have more energy. Let's see. Grow little, uh, what they call them, ancient seed plants. I play a lot of emulators. I get them on my phone mostly. I was thinking about trying to stream the fan-made games, Omicron and Zeta, but I don't know if that's allowed, so... 
they found the grass. That's good. I feel like Digimon had a space in my heart for the TV show. I don't know. I just never really played that many of the games, I guess. So, oh, look, I got a big egg. That's good for the community center. No, don't eat it. I'll go ahead and fill this up. I really liked, um, I had a little demo of Yokai Watch. That was actually pretty cool. They had a little bit of a different combat system. <laughs> I might have to give it a try. I mean, if it's got emulators too, it wouldn't hurt. I've got enough to get a cow. If Sid's still here, yeah, that was Sid. We'll have to name it Sid. Saturday, she's not open yet, so what can we do? I guess we could go forage. <laughs> there is nothing around here Saturday. Oh, look, Willie's taking a day off. What you doing down here, Willie? Hmm. I guess that means I gotta level up in fishing. Subtle hint there, Willie. So my cows are gonna look like this. Holstein cows, because that's like actual spotty cows. Almost time. There we go. Yes, let's get a cow. Okay. I'm excited. Yeah. I don't know, Lassert's a pretty good name though. That's not right. There we go. Promise has been met. Fulfilled. Let's go see this baby. She's so slow. I need to finish making the pathway I started on. See this? This is pitiful. I need to finish that up. Because this grass is tough to get through sometimes. I should probably also keep making copper bars and upgrade my pickaxe. Maybe I'll be able to get through those boulders then. <laughs> Goal in life. Look at this beautiful baby. Sid Jr. seems curious, but a little cautious. It's a strange new world. It is indeed. Go ahead and fill up that thing there. Oh, I should go down and get a bucket for when it grows up. Can I make a cheese machine? Cheese, cheese maker? <laughs> yes, very good name for a cow, I think. I don't know. I always find it funny when people name animals like people names. It's still just a name, but you know, having a cat named Jerry or something. It's kind of cool. Okay. I need to get this. Don't need the heaters yet. And I'm almost broke. Alright, looks like I can go sell all of this. Take that egg to the community center. Hmm. I think I'm going to try and make some copper today and then upgrade the pickaxe. Yay, got some more seeds. Oh, but I only have a, a day. I think I'm going to hang on to those and make them summer seeds. Okay. Anything good up here? Mm, yeah. <laughs> I see. So it's a little bit more intensive gameplay than Pokemon usually? Which one did you like better? Did you play Digimon more than Pokemon? Let's see. Saturday, yeah, he's open. Oh, it's Emily's birthday. Three herring. Might as well. Hmm.
get that for my bundle. I think it needs jazz seeds too. Mmm. 6,000 for that. Actually, I think I'll get one more of each. Because I want to have at least two. It is those flowers, right? Now I need poppy and spangle. I guess those are in summer. Okay. So community center. Then I don't really know what. <laughs> it's the last day of the season almost. So I really want to get some Junimo huts going. I can't remember if those are changed or not. Yay, first animal bundle. That's good. I think actually I could have bought wool from the lady before. I don't know. Uh, let's see, any last minute things I need to do in spring? I don't really know. I guess I could go get those spring onions. That's a last minute thing. Let's clear out some of these. See if I can get some more seeds. Always good starting off with free seeds. Hmm. Nothing. Okay. You do you, Haley. Hmm. Let's see. I wonder what the next... So the first house upgrade, I think, is $10,000. It's a long ways off. But if I can get my hands on some blueberries, I think that's what I'm going to try to do. It's almost the last day. I'm going to try to make some money if I can. So honestly, I think I'm going to fish for a little while. It might be kind of boring, but I need to make some money so I can get plenty of blueberries next season and at least one hot pepper plant. Let's see, I think this one, what is the name of this farm? I'll have to check, hang on. I have too many farms. Mod farm. My favorite farm is Halcyon farm, but. No, you didn't really miss much. It's the last couple of days, I'm just kind of getting through. Try to catch a little bit of fish. I'm gonna try and get some more copper. Let's see if I can get enough to upgrade my pickaxe. I've been kind of keeping tabs on it. What's been your the thing you've been most excited about so far? Mm. That's a monster. Super excited about Crash Bandicoot coming back out. Other than that, I haven't really been like watching it live, more trying to catch the highlights of everything. Let's see. The new footage of the uh, Mario Odyssey looked pretty awesome. I think they said they're going to do a remake of... Was it Shadow of the Colossus? That looked pretty good, too. Oh, no. Here we go. It really does, though, right? It's... I can't believe we haven't actually had... Um, this style of gameplay since the Nintendo 64 version of it, but it looks incredible, and I'm super excited to like take control of people with the hat. 
I think that's going to be really fun. I honestly originally kind of thought the hat looked a little silly, but if the gameplay is fun, I don't think it's going to matter. Yes, finally got the mining to level up. Oh, I wonder what the... <laughs> Gotta get the hat. Yeah. I think it's going to be really great. I am just... I just wish they would have had it come out like when the Switch came out. But I guess it's good to save one title for the Christmas holiday title. Here we go. Got a way down. Oh, wait. Okay. Uh, it's 5.30. Energy's doing okay. Almost to the dark levels. 28. Let's see. Okay. Oop. Gotta get that. Oh, inventory's full. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, those things looked really cool, too. I... I really gotta sit down and watch everything through. I've kind of been trying to figure this stuff out. Not really paying as much attention as I normally do, but I think I'll eat this. I'll have to go back and check it out. Well, I can't reach it. I need the magnet ring. Hmm. I still am laughing about your Mario looks amaze balls. I feel like we've got the best generation of people as far as video games go. You know, like you get around a bunch of our folks. I don't know, I feel like, oh, here we go, the dark levels. Just find the ladders. Find the ladders and get out of here. Almost down to level 40. I really hate these things. Oh gosh, especially those that just appear out of nowhere. Look, I'm doing like no damage anyway. Oh. There, there's the ladder. Oh, get me out of here. Okay. Who Can I get two more? Can I get two more? Yes, look, there's a ladder, but I kind of want to see what's in here. Oh my gosh. I might just get out of this alive. It's not too bad right now. <laughs> that is too perfect for down here. I really... I don't even know what it looks like on the screen. I really don't like the dark levels, though. Oh, what can I throw away? Mm. I don't know. I guess this is less valuable. Look, I think I might just use this. Yep, that's much more effective. Yes! So much better. I should have done this a long time ago. Okay gonna make it. I believe. I didn't see a ladder pop up, did you? Oh gosh! Leave me alone! Please give me a ladder, please. I didn't see one. It's so dark. Hmm. I think there was one over there. No. This is bad. I really I really hate this place down here. <sighs> Last bomb. I am totally getting hit by these. I didn't see a ladder anywhere. I really wanted to get out of this. 
Is that one? No. Just a wall. Oh my goodness. Let me out. <laughs> I don't like this, guys. <laughs> He's gonna get me in the corner. Oh my word. Maybe one of these bugs will drop it. Jeez, leave me alone. <sighs> okay. Wow, okay. Woo, got out of that one. Seriously, though, this is like the scariest part of the whole game. Run away! Don't touch me! Scary dude! <laughs> Please give me the ladder somewhere. This is pretty much how this always goes every time I reach these levels. Running away from these dudes. Oh, Omni Geode! Awesome! Come on, though. It's so close. Mm. I'm so close to finding the next ladder, I'm sure. Guess I gotta leave, but got some good progress. Do you have the ladder? It's 12.30. Oh, he did have the ladder. Oh, we're so close, though. I kind of want to just keep going. Look, ladder! <laughs> I kind of want to just keep going and pass out. Can I eat anything? Oh, because if I could just be done with this, that would be the best. Is there a ladder somewhere in here? Please? I'd rather pass out and be done with this. Oh, shoot. Come on, bat. Please have the ladder. Please. I don't have much time. Please. I don't know. No! Okay, okay. I can't pass out in the mines because I'll lose them. Right? I'll lose all these levels, so it's not even worth it. God, but so close. That really makes me mad. Okay. I don't think I'm going to make it. Unless I... Just do that. Let's just do that. Ho, ho, ho! <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so frustrating. Ugh! so frustrating. <sighs> Can't even cook yet, lady. Man, so close to 40. Mm. Okay, well, you need to donate that. Mm. Still mad. Let's see. I think I've got enough coal to make a bee house, though, so that's good. Let's see. Bee house. Iron, coal, wood, maple syrup. Okay. Iron, coal, wood, and maple syrup. So I gotta chop some trees down. Oh, wow. Can I do it now? 40 wood. No. Okay. Let's see if we got any good trees to chop down on the way to the animals. Oh, I haven't even checked um, Mushroom Cave yet. Hey, look at that. Got some good mushrooms. Inventory's full, though. I think I'm just going to focus on chopping down some trees. Get this bee house built. All right. Yay, so happy. Okay. Wow, look at that. This UI thing shows you how far the bee house sees. Huh. I, 
can put it right there. I don't really like that, but that's cool. Wow. Hmm. That's right, I need to feed Sid Jr. Okay, let's see. Let's just put it right there. Let's see what we got going on with the animals today. Hey, look, he's found his way out. Or she. I don't know, it wouldn't be a he if I got milk. Sweet. Still a baby. All right. There we go. I kind of like my animals being free range. You know, just do whatever they want. Yeah, there's plenty of food in there. Okie doke. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I got a lot of stuff in here. Stick some of it in a chest and go see the blacksmith. I gotta remember, 12 o'clock. I need to go find that plushie. Okay. 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 Gotta donate that. I should still water these two at least. Because they're gonna be sticking around. Okay. Mario. I I really grew up with Mario, not Sonic, but I did play some. I was just being asked the uh, yesterday, my husband just asked if what I thought about the new Sonic stuff coming out, and I was like, hmm. I don't know. The the different games, I don't like the 2D games as much for Sonic as I did the 2D games for Mario. You know what I'm saying? Like, for me, I felt like Sonic was, I only really enjoyed the Sonic games where you were, like, positioned behind Sonic and you could do kind of the 3D world thing. But I really enjoyed almost all the Mario games. Yeah, right? Let's see. I don't need to be here. I need to be at the blacksmith. That's what I'm saying. Like, I grew up... I think my first... One of my first Game Boy games was... Well, no. Pokemon was one of my first. But Mario was the first one that I played of those two. And then also, growing up before even that, playing the Mario 64... So definitely that. Okay, please be something good. Ah, that's okay, I guess. Coal is good, always. Very cool, okay. Let's go down here. You know, this guy of all, pe all the people has the best hours. Open till six. Oh, got something new. Let's see. What do we get? That's cool. I wonder if it still looks like that in the house. <sighs> Things are not what they seem. I never was either. I honestly... I feel like I just kept playing the same levels over and over. Like, I really loved the penguin level. Because you could go down the race... And all, another thing I remember was running around in the flower patches for whatever reason. I think you get coins or something or a star sometimes. My dad had to help me through a lot when I was growing up play that game. And then he finally got me to Bowser. Scariest thing ever when you're walking towards Peach's portrait and it turns into Bowser and the floor opens up. Spoiler alert, by the way, if anybody never played it. But... God, that scared me so bad. And then, like, he said, if you want to beat the game, you got to do it on your own. So he played through the entire game almost, and then I had to beat Bowser. Mario World. 
Are you talking about like the Super Mario World? Or the the ones with the maps and everything? Yeah, those are different. What am I doing up here? What am I doing today? Oh my gosh, okay, I need to close out. Look, I missed it. Do you see that? 1240, I missed it, you guys. Okay, I gotta do this. Shoot, I think it is right at 12, right? Let's, let's, I'm gonna go see. I'm gonna go see if I can even still do it. And if not, uh, I don't know. I might just, no, I really don't wanna wait. I think I'm gonna close out and open it back up. I don't wanna wait a whole nother season. I loved Mario 3. Yeah, I think that was my favorite too. I have to get this thing. I told myself so many times. Nope. I Okay, that's it. Okay, we're going to get it. We're going to get it. I got to remember. I'm going to get this thing. Honestly, you really can't go wrong with any of them, I feel like. I even liked, there was a, I played, I think it was on the Wii? I don't know, Paper Mario? Those are pretty cool. Even, so, there are very few Mario games that I don't like. Hmm. Exactly, that's what I'm trying to get, right? I gotta get there exactly at 12. Hmm. Goodness. I told myself I was going to get that the whole time, and then I just forgot. Okay. Yeah, I think that's fine. I hadn't made my bee house yet either, so. Ugh. Coal, iron, maple. Chop down some trees several minutes behind. Oh, maybe you had, like, scrolled back to look for something. <laughs> That's weird. Yeah, I know. Man. I totally forgot. Okay, so, gotta get 40 wood. Okay, it's eight. So by the time I get over there, I should be able to get to the blacksmith and hurry on up. Uh, yeah. All right, okay, gotta, gotta get this down. So water those. I'm trying to remember everything I did yesterday, or today, this day. Stick some stuff in a chest, it's 8.30. Oh my goodness, okay. I think I'll be fine. 840. <laughs> Ugh. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so the blacksmith's open. We can at least go do that. Go get the geode. Outlast? No. We've I've played I've well not played, but I've um watched some gameplay of that game and it was so scary. But I know it's a popular thing to stream scary games. Perhaps perhaps I might try sometime. I was wondering if I would get the same things. Or not. Yeah, same exact things, okay. Oh my word. I feel like I would um, break the mic or something with all the little little girly screams I would be doing. That game is so scary. Okay. 
but really fun. It's really fun to play like with a group of friends or something. I don't know. I, I really enjoy those kind of things even more than if you just go and watch a scary movie because somebody has to play it, you know? Mmm. Yeah. Why? That's no good. Let's see. It's 1020. Yeah. <laughs> it's so scary. There are games that could scare me that are way less terrifying than that. That would be more fun. Like, have there have been a lot of people who enjoy playing um, Little Nightmares that's been popular recently. Even that thing would make me jump. And it's nowhere, nowhere near as scary as... Uh, I don't have anything to turn in here. Nowhere near as scary as Outlast. It's 11. I'm not going to miss this again. So I'm just going to go up there, stand there, and wait. I'm going to get this thing. Got it. There we go. Mission accomplished. I can move on now. Sorry for having to replay half the day. Alright. What was I even doing after that? I have no idea. But uh, I think I need to... <laughs> yeah, awkward silence while I sip my coffee. That's what this is all about. Just hanging out. <laughs> hydration or dehydration it's actually a big old thing of coffee coffee okay best tips for making money making money unfortunately I think it's fishing but that's not very fun really I think I gotta get past this little bit in the mines now that I have a chance we're gonna do this I don't even know what my luck is today but I really hate these dudes a lot, and I really wish I could find a ladder and just get lucky. What is this blocking me? Okay. Maybe it was a ladder. Oh, here we go. Okay. Ooh, ooh. There's one right there, too. I'm gonna do this so I don't have to face my scary zombie friends down here. Oh, and they sound so freaky, too. Don't touch me. <laughs> this is actually a pretty lucky day. Look, I even got a minecart. You did not know that plush? Well, it's a good thing you're here. Yeah, on it's on the 28th at noon in any season. So you can do it any time of the year. I'm so close, guys. I just need one more level and I'll be out of this freaky place. Yeah, you can get the Junimo plush the 28th day at noon. And I think there are mods that can turn it into stuff. I'm going to go stick it in my house and see if my furniture mod does anything. <gasps> oh, I think we did it. Yeah. Hallelujah. Made it out. No one needs this. Slingshot. I have never used that ever. Is my journal freaking out? Because I think it's supposed to be. Yes. I'm not going to do that. Okay. Well, I'm pretty happy. I'm gonna go see what this stuff does in my house. Yay. And go make some copper bars because I wanna upgrade my pickaxe now that I'm going down to the iron levels. Yeah. Yeah. It's just gonna go in a chest. I really want, see this, this recoloring is a, this is what Stardew normally looks like, this is what mine looks like. It's pretty different. No, you can't. You can't get rid of it at all. The dude won't buy it. I don't know what to do. You know what? Have you? Here's what I want to try. I wonder if I go fishing with a full backpack, if it would let me dump it. Oh, really? Really? I think I might try that. I'm going to stick it in the way 
That's a good idea. I've seen people try to blow it up in the chest and it didn't work, so I think I might try that. Let's see what the geode looks like in here. Does it look like a geode? Yep. Let's see what the plushie looks like in here. Still looks like a plushie. <laughs> 20 sprinklers now. I've only got 80 more sprinklers, Morty. Gonna be doing this 99 more years. Okay. Sell all the things. Could take that. And I may make another, uh, what you call it? Otavio, thanks for joining. Let's see. Hope you're having a great Friday. Okay, how many copper bars do I have? I want to have at least five so that I can upgrade my pickaxe. I have none. So I need to just have 25 of those or, which means I can make another one of these. Three's a good number. Hmm. Where to put my furnaces? Well, what am I doing? That's not what I want to do. Yeah, that would be good. I've tried that before. Had a little chest over there. Can I not put this right here? Hmm, guess not. But for some reason, I just like having them right around in this area better. I've done it. You know, maybe once I get the mine carts, that would be more convenient. I don't guess I've pet my cat today or watered it. Hmm. There we go. Hmm. Lazy last day of the month. Dude's closed. I wonder if I can catch anything good on this farm or not. Wow, I can't even go that far. Oh, you can catch fish on here. Aha! I love the level up sound. Well, I honestly think I think that's going to be a, it for this day. I'm going to hang on to that. Hmm? I'll put that in there. I'm going to make a chest and do that thing you said. And I think I'm going to call that a day. And I've been streaming for about two hours now. So I think I'm going to call this a day for this stream as well. And I plan on being on tomorrow about the same time at noon central time. And playing some Skyrim tomorrow. So I appreciate everybody who stopped by today for this stream. Let's see what we get for this last level up. Oh my goodness, wait, before we go. Gotta go with Fisher. Easy choice. Okay. Anyway, thank you all for stopping by. I think I'm going to end the stream here, and I'll be back on tomorrow at 12. Have a great Friday. Thanks.